Hey guys, what's going on? Today we got a V Jump Scan November issue update, and I am super freaking hyped. I freaking, I actually, I got super excited when I saw it. Uh, the reasoning because it's Super Saiyan 3 Bardock. So as you see over here, I got the image on my screen. This is the Super Saiyan 3 Bardock. I know it's a little bit hard, it's hard to like get in without it blurring out and everything like that. But this is the Super Saiyan 3 Bardock that is going to be available. Super hyped for it. I can't wait. I cannot wait for this card. Um, obviously, it's not going to be on the JP side, so I'm not going to be able to pull it. So that adds a second category leader that I really, really want. Second category leader that I want. First one, Hybrid Saiyan. I would like the Omega, but not because of the, the Shadow Dragon team. More specifically, because I want him on a mono extreme physical team. So uh, in terms of leader abilities, his is awesome. And the card. Oh my god, that card. I can't wait. Now, let's go ahead and talk about it first. So this was from the V-Jump magazine. Go ahead, check it out. I actually saw the post from Nordak, and um, I came on the Reddit just to check it out. So shout out to the Reddit. Shout out to Qualison for the image and the translations. <laughs> uh, so wait, let's see, what, what is this over here? PBS.org, I actually didn't open these up. So we're gonna wait for that to open. This is gonna be an Intelligence SSJ3 Bardock, by the way. Note the color scheme of the, oh, look at that. He actually did zoom into it for us. That's awesome. Um, oh, that's the full page. Oh, cool, look at that. All right, so we have the Super Saiyan 3 Bardock up over here. Let's see what we can see. This is the first time I'm actually looking at this. Um, ultra rare, Dokum Max level 120. All right. Uh, here is SSR. Yeah, it looks like this is the intelligence over here. Wow, I zoomed in a lot, huh? All right, intelligence over here. Looks like he's going to have his own specific event, which is cool. Uh, what do we got over here? This is the dude. <laughs> I love his freaking character dress ups. It's freaking nuts. Oh, man. He lo he's actually... It reminds me of Mr. Satan a little bit. I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, SSR, level 100. This is the agility Bardock, by the way. The agility, the base form Bardock, Super Saiyan Bardock. He does Dokken Wake, and we're going to talk about that, too. Oh, man. I'm super hyped about this. Uh, this is the first time in a long time I've legit, like, down to, like, my gut been excited for our new card. Like, all the cards are cool, and I get happy for them, and I'm excited. But this is the first time that, in a very long time, uh, I think, honestly... I'm pretty sure until, a point, I think Korra and Full Power Freeze the combo. Once I saw that, that was like the really last time I got into a super, super hype position. Uh, at least that I could remember. Uh, and Super Saiyan 4s, obviously. But that was just like, that, that was a different kind of hype. This is just like a touch home, kid childish feeling come out type of hype. <laughs> so this is freaking awesome. I'm trying to see if I note anything else in here. You got Goku flying in. Um, v jump, yeah. There's nothing else really over here, but this is freaking awesome. Super Saiyan three Bardock is coming. Uh, the agility one, I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna feed in dupe system. I'm gonna have to get four more, uh, max them out and wait for the Dokkan event so I can throw some uh, max. I'm not like full potential into him, but I want to make sure I get some good stuff in there. Uh, plus, it also means he is semi formable. Uh, honestly, my me, I'm probably gonna still keep those uh, agility Super Saiyans outside of the ones I want to Dokkan awaken. I'm probably gonna keep them to keep on feeding into the Super Saiyan Bardocks I have because there's just I have all of them. Oh, man, this is awesome. Anyway, uh, let's talk about him really quick. Oh, such a cool freaking looking uh, poster over here. Anyway, uh, in Super Saiyan 3, Bardock will be Dokken Fest for November. He requires 77 medals to Dokken Waken. Um, he is a Super Saiyan 3 category leader, which is awesome because of all the Super Saiyan 3s that are available. Obviously, most of them are uh, no, like heroes. Uh, I think there's only one that's not a hero, and that is the Broly, Super Saiyan 3 Broly. But if you have Super Saiyan 3 Broly, that's freaking phenomenal. So, uh, you know, I might actually, uh, I kind of want to go in on the banner now, because on the JP side, we did get the 300 stones on top of the 170 that I already had. So I kind of want to go in on the banner at the same time, holidays right around the corner, and there's going to be good banners. If it overlaps, hopefully it will overlap with some of the holiday stuff, but I don't think so. I think it's going to end by that time. Oh, anyway, um, Agility Super Saiyan Bardock will Dokken Wake into Agility Super Saiyan 3 Bardock with 21 medals. Unfortunately, we don't have any information at this time. Obviously, this is a V-Jump scan leak. It's not gonna. It's not actual data download. Um, his title is something to the effect of Awakening in the Rift of Time. Uh, his Dokken Awakening is Testimony of Power of Saiyans. And the Agility SSR Super Saiyan 3 Bardock title will be Super uh, sorry Saiyan Warrior on the Counter-Attack. Super freaking hyped about it. Um, I'm trying to see if there's anything else. I think that's everything. This is the Agility Super Saiyan Bardock, by the way. This is his Z Awakened form. Um, he's an SR, he Z Awakens to an SSR. Now he's finally, after so long, is going to get Dokken Awakening. Everyone wanted to go Super Saiyan 2 also, I believe, but I'm um, pretty sure that wasn't a thing. I don't know. But it is, Super Saiyan 3 is awesome. Oh, man. All right, but yeah, guys, that's it. I just wanted to go over that quick news release. I am so 
freaking hyped. I might actually go in on the JP side for this card because I am hyped about it. But anyway, guys, thank you for joining me here today. Let me know what your thoughts are down in the comments below, and I'll catch you all later.